Hi, I'm Fred Dixon, product manager for Big Blue Button, the world's only open source virtual classroom built by teachers for teachers. Big Blue Button is built by a worldwide community of teachers, educational institutions, developers, and commercial companies, some of which have hosted over 3 billion minutes of online classes. This community has also localized Big Blue Button in over 55 languages, making it truly a global teaching platform for the world. This video covers our new release that, based on feedback from teachers, contains numerous usability improvements along with a new feature that we're calling the Learning Analytics Dashboard, which gives you live insight on students' activities during your online class. Let's take a closer look. Background blur for webcams has been a highly requested feature. As you can see here, when I share my webcam, I have the option of choosing different background images. And if I click blur, you'll see my background blur as well. This is great for users that want to reduce distractions coming from their background or want to maintain their privacy. You'll also notice that when I share my webcam, everyone can see an indicator next to my name in the users list. This helps everyone to see who's sharing their webcam in large classes when you're paging through groups of webcams. You can now change the names of breakout rooms, making the breakout rooms more relevant to your topic, so you're teaching, or more fun. For example, if you're encouraging competition between breakout rooms and each group wants their own team name, you can now assign them. You can also extend the time of breakout rooms as needed, giving those groups more time for collaboration. Big Blue Button now supports anonymous polling, which when discussing sensitive topics is beneficial for both student privacy and encouraging participation. With anonymous polls, you won't see individual responses and nor will they appear in the Learning Analytics dashboard, which we'll cover in a moment. When using the built-in capabilities to share external videos, such as YouTube or Vimeo, your students now see a simpler interface that only lets them adjust their volume, while you still have full control over the playback of the video. For example, you can start and stop at specific moments to focus their attention on content that you want to cover during the class. And later in the recording, students will now see the links to the shared videos, as well as the polling results, giving them more context when they're watching the recording. Big Blue Button now bolds your chat messages for students in the chat area. This makes it easier for students to distinguish your messages from others. A small change, but a very useful one. And here's the part we're most excited about. A common feedback we hear from teachers is the challenge of assessing students' performance during their online class. This makes sense as an online class operates in a different medium, especially when compared to a physical classroom, which offers all the traditional cues for assessing performance. To help in this assessment, we developed the Learning Analytics Dashboard, a live dashboard that during your online class gives you insights into your students' attendance, engagement, and learning based on their responses to polls. And unlike looking at a static report after your class is over, the Learning Analytics Dashboard gives you this insight during your live class where the information can be the most helpful. You can think of it as your co-pilot when teaching. We can't wait to see how teachers use these insights to help them teach their class online. That's an overview of this new release, and we want to thank all the teachers that have gave us feedback throughout its development. You can try out the latest release on our demo server, see the links below, and to learn more about these features, check out our one-minute tutorial videos, also linked below. Thanks for watching.